Grand Rising family. I hope everyone is having an absolutely positively wonderful morning. I hope you woke up on the right side of the bed. Whichever side you put your feet down on is the right side. And I hope y'all got y'all water, y'all coffee, y'all fruit, whatever it is you need to get on down the road for this morning. I hope you get it. And before I get started, I just want to say, Scorpio family, I love you. And I pray that today is one of the best days of your life because you opened up your beautiful eyes. You are worthy. You are victorious. And anything that steps in your way going to get ran the fuck over. <laughs> and just be like, just to the left, to the left. Just go to the left. You don't want to get ran over by this bum, 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 freight truck. You feel me? Because, uh, baby, we just in this bitch. In this bitch. Hey, we in this bitch. In this bitch. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, family. But yeah, so let's get into this reading. Okay. Where are we going to start at? Most high. What is it that our powerful, brilliant, sexy ass, mm, smelling good Scorpios need to know? Messages of clarity. Okay. So right now, family, I see. Oh, anxiety. Someone is very anxious and scared. I feel like if this is you, Scorpio, which I hope not, because you know, we are anxious for nothing. Everything happens in our favor. We still in this empress energy where we just manifesting and things coming to us. But there's somebody that's anxious. Somebody is in a panic state. Why are they panicking? Mm. I feel like somebody feels trapped that wants to be free. I'm looking at this phone. Somebody is, somebody really wants to reach out to you, Scorpio. Spirit is saying. This person feels tied down with watching images of you on their phone. They feel like all they could do right now is watch and not uh, act. Because they feel restrained because of some type of situation. I'm seeing here, uh, it says plug, tuned in, internet connected. So, like I said, uh, with this, it's like somebody is trapped watching you on their phone. They're very much connected to you on the internet, whatever it is, especially if you are a social influencer or if you have, like, you could be a YouTuber or something where they're able to see you every day. I feel like the more they watch you, the more compelled they get with your energy and wanting to say something, reach out, send a text. Oh. Yeah, this person is heavily plugged into whatever channels or pages you have. Somebody is wanting a commitment with you, Scorpio. They are wanting to hurry up and I'm getting the energy of like water rushing. Somebody wants to rush in so fast to cook, to give you some type of commitment. Somebody is looking at you like, I, I got to have it. I got to have Scorpio. But this person has marriage on their mind. I don't want to say but, but, and this person, you know, you say but means something going to come back. And this person has marriage on their mind. So I don't know, Scorpio, you looking like, you looking like husband, wifey material over there with your sexy self. Look like you about to bag one this year. Look at you. You about to bag one. <laughs> <laughs> they my, motherfuckers finally having good taste, huh? They tied all that damn toxic shit. <laughs> okay, I'm going back to the reading. Just put my little tea in there. All right, most high. What is this? Mm -hmm. On the table. Somebody wants to put an offer, a proposal, a commitment on the table. And this is why they're panicking right here. This is why they're stressed out. Someone is really trying to find out how are they going to present you this offer. And I feel like they're stuck in their mind trying to make a uh, plan it out. You could be dealing with an air sign, a water sign, because with these cords, make me feel like it's like a, a somebody is tangling with themselves emotionally on how to present an offer to you. 
And I feel like because they're plugged in, they're seeing something about you. I feel like this person knows that you may have options. This person may have options, may have a lot of options as well. But right now, I feel like they somebody wants to come in and uh, give you give you some type of offer. They feel like there's such a connection. They want to talk to you. So I feel like there could be a message coming soon, as soon as this person figures out what they how they want to go step by step and getting into contact with you. I feel like this person wants to take you out, want to have some drinks. They feel like you are their two of cups. <clears throat> And I feel like they want to know, like, where you are uh, in wanting a connection like this. Ooh, okay. Yeah. This person feels weighed down. This person feels weighed down with the ideas and thoughts. Like, watching you every day is making, is, I feel like this person is starting to watch you more. And the more they watch you, the more impatient they get with wanting you in their life. They're like, uh-uh, I got to have Scorpio. I don't care what nobody say. I got to get my Scorpio. And they they are wanting a, a commitment bad. Somebody is realizing the truth. I feel like somebody could have been connected to somebody and they realized whoever they was connected to was uh the goddamn devil. <laughs> And, they, and 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 I feel like as they were connected to somebody, they were they were they were observing you, and now it's like they realize the cup they were pouring into was empty, and it, and it's like if the cup had a hole in it, like a penny with a hole in it, and they just like why do I keep pouring into this empty vessel? And now this person been observing you, and now they become more aware because I feel like this individual found out about something in their past, whoever was their past connection. And, and I feel like right now they're just like, you know what, I'm not, I don't want to invest in anything that I'm not going to, um, you know, kind of like reap the benefits from. I mean, who invests in something and don't expect a return? I mean, that's, that's the, you know, the whole point of investing. So you can, you know, get something back, goddamn it. But you just give me your money, you ain't done. You might as well just, that's a goddamn liability. Like buying a car. As soon as you run that bitch off the lot, it's, it's already devalued, baby. You just threw away some colorful money. <laughs> Shit ain't real anyway. But anyway, okay. Most high. Um, I do feel like spirit says whatever this energy is, that uh, this gonna be something you might want to write about. Makes me feel like it's a love story about to unfold. Ooh, spirit, break it down for us. Break it down. This is just a clarity and truth. Ooh, this just spilled off. I guess I'm a. Okay, let me see, spirit. This person. What is some of their gifts? Let's see about this person a little bit. Okay. Spirit, what are some of this person's gifts that's trying to come towards us? What are some of their gifts? What are the things they possess? Self-love. So this person right now, Spirit is saying, is practicing self-love because whoever they have, they have removed themselves from, uh, this person was showing them that they didn't love themselves. Kind of like this person they put up healthy boundaries with, with an individual. And right now, they feel like you are the healthy lifestyle for them. And whoever they left, I feel like now they're coming towards you because they feel like you're going to be good for them. Like, you're good for their soul. Oh, I need a healer for my soul. Give me a healer for my soul. Who is that? Can I get a healer for my soul? I need a chest for my soul. I need it. Oh, what? Oh my God, I got the chills. Hey, if you guys know who wrote that song, go listen to that song. This person wants you to listen to that. Uh, is it Kelly Price? I need a healer for my soul. Give me a healer for my soul. If that's it, I think it's Kelly Price. Healer for my soul. Uh, if you want to know what this person is really feeling when they see you, Spirit says, go listen to that. Aww. Oh. Okay. Okay. Pineapples. Okay, so this person, their gifts is uh, clear sentience. You have the ability to feel deeply into situations, places, or people sensing something beyond the physical realm. So this person feels that you guys have a connection, a connection that they they haven't uh, understood this go around or, or that they haven't uh, probably experienced in this life. But they do feel like you guys are connected. See, hence why I'm seeing this two of clubs and 
Another thing Spirit says this person is just like you, Scorpio, is, oh, wait, I'm just not showing y'all the pictures. Okay, so this is when this person is expressing self-love. That's the reason why they're coming towards you. And clear sentience, this person feels like there's something deeper to you guys' connection that they have, that they are, they are anxious to explore. And I feel right here with this royalty. Spirit says that you guys are a royal. I don't know if they're going to cut that off. <laughs> Spirit says that this person is, is royalty. Just like you, you have royal qualities that command power and causes extreme reactions. You're either loved or hated, challenging them to become better. So Spirit says this person, y'all both have royal uh, characteristics, meaning you both are powerful. You both call attention. You both are, de uh, are demanding of some type of excellence. And this is the person that is, that, that is trying to get to you, Scorpio. Mm-hmm. All right, most high, what else should we know? Okay, so we got a person anxious. They are watching you. They feel burdened by not coming towards you. And I feel like now they realize that you are the connection that they want to be in. Yeah, this person sees you as a ten of cups. This person feels that you, this person wants to have children with you if they can. If not, they want to watch, they want to be with you as, as you guys grow seasoned. Ooh, this person said, I want to <laughs> with two babies. I just know you taste better. Yeah, this person could feel in, in the energy, this part with the five of pentacles, five of cups. This person um, is kind of like, I feel like this person was in another situation and they kind of regret being in that situation because whatever that, that situation was, that's what kept them held back from even reaching out to you when they first realized that you were someone that they wanted to pursue in that deeper level. Mm -hmm. I feel like right now with the five of swords, this is the energy of somebody could have been uh, lying about about wanting a connection or I feel like on a spirit. What is this five of swords? Yeah. Oh, uh, this person feel bad because they were working with somebody that I feel like was a liar. And now uh, this person is disconnected from an individual. They stopped giving to somebody that that wasn't appreciative. And Spirit says, now they're waiting. They're waiting to connect with you. Because whoever this was, uh, it was a third party. So it's like this. The person that's coming in towards you, they were in another situation. They regret even being in that situation because they felt that it wasn't even good for them while they were in it. And 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 right now, this person, this, whoever they were with, did something very... Spirit says they did something very scandalous with somebody that they knew. And like they 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 finally let that situation go. They're not given to this individual no more. And they said they're very happy now because now they see you as a wish fulfillment. But now it's kind of like how they see you as a wish fulfillment. But it's like, how do I go along the lines of fulfilling the wishes to get the fulfillment? Yeah. It's why I try to figure out some shit. <laughs> So, and this person said, hey, I know you was running. This person about to come running towards you. So, okay, Spirit, is there anything else? Is there anything else uh, my Scorpio should know about this individual person, Spirit? Mm. Yeah, Spirit says that this person is tired of uh, not showing their feelings. They want a new beginning. And whoever this person is, I do feel like if you're if you're in the childbearing stages, this person is going to want to have a baby. I feel like with this new beginning, we'll bring in a child very soon. Also, Spirit says this person wants to introduce you to their family. They feel like you are a perfect fit. And and the thing is, they said that like the person that they had before, they, they didn't introduce them to their uh, community because they knew that they were not the one. And this person's going to look at you, Scorpio, and be like, they already feel it. They're just going to be like, you the one. So whatever that means to you, Scorpios, I love you, family. Y'all have a wonderful day with your sexy self. And I'm going to see you in just a minute. So don't go nowhere. Well, go to work if you have to, but you know, you know what I mean. Stay tuned. <laughs>